All right, guys. Um, last episode, we finally got copper ore and tin ore, and um, what we found. Oh shoot! We found out. Um, oh god! Oh god! And then this stuff. This ha started happening. Jesus. Yeah, this is basically the Richthier one, but the forest is moving is what happened. So I was going to craft the upgrade of the Stag Breaker, and then this started happening. I'm going to die, guys. I'm going to die. Oh, Jesus. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Try to lure them away from my home, so at least my home doesn't get damaged. Hopefully not. Man, right? Could you have waited before I upgraded my stag breaker? For this, the stag breaker would have helped a lot in this situation. Oh man, here we go. Okay, run, run. Oh god, I'm gonna die, guys. I'm gonna die. Well, at least I got the Grey Dwarf down. Oh, I'm dead, guys. I am dead. I am really dead, guys. Oh, Jesus. Oh, thank God the event's over. The force is moving still? Uh, again? Again? Another gray dwarf brute. Oh, I am screwed, guys. The forest rests again. Thank God. Does that mean you guys disappear? Nope. It does not mean they disappear, unfortunately. Okay. Three. All right, here we go. Man, I can't wait to upgrade this thing. So we had to find out, unfortunately, in order to process the copper ore and everything, to turn the copper ore... Sorry, I'm sitting back. To turn the copper ore into copper, we have to, um, what is this thing? Oh, it's a stone. In order to turn the copper ore into copper, we need the certain core, which means we need to explore the burial chamber, which is why I was going to upgrade the stag breaker. Um, ideally, we'd want to get the more troll armor if we could, but I don't want to. Here we go, stag breaker. I was just about to get the deer trophies when they show when that whole thing showed up, which was crazy. I felt bad kind of leaving you guys in a cliffhanger, but it was a long episode as it was already. Um, there we go. So our original, our current damage for the stag breaker is 20 blunt and five pierce. 20 blunt and five pierce. So with this, with the upgrade to the stag breaker. What? What happened? Oh, did they ruin one of my crafting things? It's the chopping block, huh? They ruined the chopping block. Frick. Yeah, the chopping block was one of the things I got. The chopping block. There we go. Maybe we're here, I don't know where to put it. I don't know where to put it, guys. Wait, right there was right there was really good actually. Right there. Alright. So now I should be able to do it. There we go. Stag breaker. All right, so it was 20 blunt and it's 20, 26 blunt and five pierce, so that's about six damage more. So it's a bit more damage. We need crafting level four for, yeah, we're gonna need crafting level four for the next one for, for stag breaker. And there's not much else I can upgrade except for the deer hide. I could upgrade that, but I'm missing one. For Everything else requires four level. <sighs> All right, so we got this. We're gonna, we're gonna put the neck trophy or the step. Man, that was a crazy. 
I thought the Rick Thier one was crazy, but this one was even... I almost died, guys. I was so close to death. Alright, so we're putting somewhere we need as much meat as we can get. Alrighty. I'm gonna make sure we have everything as much as we can before we go. Alright, so... In the next clip, we'll be at the burial chamber, and it's gonna be fun! Yay! I wonder if it looks any different, the stag breaker. Does it have more antlers on it or something? The, uh, the shock force seems to be higher for it. Oh, not you again. Okay, so in the next clip, I'm going to activate this. What? I can't... I can't activate? I don't know, that's weird. So the next clip will uh, be at the burial chamber. Alright guys, it's time to go into the burial chamber. I have no idea what to expect. I haven't looked hardly anything up on the wiki. So, but here we go. Oh, Jesus, here we go. Oh, man, this is terrifying already. I've got two branching paths. We're going to get loads of bone fragments on the bright side, I think. Oh, God. I didn't know there was a path open this way. Shoot. Jesus. We are going to get so many bone fragments, guys. these good mushrooms? Oh, oh shoot, there's the Sirdling core. That's what we're here for. Awesome. Oh, we got more than one. Holy moly. Alrighty then. Time to regroup and heal a little bit here for a little bit. All right, so we got Sirtling Core. We got that was freaky, but a little bit easier than I thought. What's through this door here? More gold mushrooms. Oh Jesus! We're getting bone fragments left and right here. This is great for upgrading with the stuff. Amber pearl. No room in inventory. I don't need wood. Man, it's going to be easy to get lost. Is there anything on the map? Nope. I was really hoping there was going to be a burial chamber map here. Alright guys, I'm leaving. It was nice. I had I had some fun. It was a good trip. How much space do I have? Oh, 134. I'm going to drop resin here. Okay. Ghost. It's a g g g g g ghost what shall we do? Did I get ectoplasm? Like, what, what drops from that? Jesus, it was damaging me a lot, though. Oh, shoot, there's a sigil here. Oh, 
Oh god, this place is creepy. It's really creepy. Not in a good way. Oh shoot, I unlocked the elder spot. Holy moly. I unlocked the Oh shit, it's on the map now. Oh Jesus. Things got even more real just now, guys. I should eat more honey here. Okay, let let yourself heal up a little bit. Alright, now we go. Well, I don't think I'm going to need bone fragments for a little while, at least. I'm kind of caught up on bone fragments for a little bit. This is it's a very homey place. Oh, there's another certain core. Oh, dear. Jesus. Well, how many Circling Cores did I... Oh, and I got the awesome Skeleton Trophy, too. That's so cool. That is badass. That is badass. This is awesome. This does remind me of the Elder Scrolls exploring caves and crypts and stuff. So I think I've explored everything there is to explore. Unless I'm mistaken. There's resin here. It's so easy to get yourself lost. Oh, I thought I had explored everything. Make no bones about it, I hadn't. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. I like how they glow. They remind me of the day shrooms from Plants vs. Zombies. There's a zombie. Wait a minute, there's rocks here. Nope. This massive skeleton comes up out of nowhere. You messed with the wrong crypt. You shall pay. You shall pay. You are doomed. You shall become one of us now. You shall become one of us. No, oh, wait, that's, that's just, that does not sound creepy at all. Okay. All right. So I was finally able to do it. I, I did it. I beat your crypt. Crypt keeper. Crypt keeper, come and kiss my feet. That's right. I went through that and you still challenge me, Grayling. She'll leave you within an inch of your life, as Triple H would say. Within an inch of your life. Goodbye. Go back home. Wee. All right, so I'll go back home, and then we'll see what we can do, guys. This is exciting. Oh, my God. Yes. All right, guys. We're back at our old home here. Now we can craft. Oh, Jesus. Certling core. We need stone. <laughs> That's hard to come by now. Not really, no. Charcoal kiln. Oh, Jesus. And you need the workbench, too. And, yeah, shoot. All right. So we got something. We need stone. Health 20. This one is health 15. So the gold ones are better. It's like I figured they would be. Alrighty. I'll craft a smelter. Oh, Jesus, the smelter is massive. I'm gonna have to expand my house or something. I don't know what to do. This thing is huge. Absolutely ridiculously huge. I have to build it outside or something? I suppose I could build it down here. But I think I got a better spot I can do it. Let's see. Over here. 
where it's I had that section part off but I think it'll still be enough to trigger if I need it for another get yeah it seems like a good spot Oh, Jesus. You scared the shit out of me, Huggin. You deposit your raw in this furnace, it'll melt away all the impurities, leaving you with a bar of fine metal to work at the forge. You will need coal to fuel the smelter, which can be produced by building a kiln and loading it with wood. Charcoal kiln. Alright. Charcoal kiln. Charcoal kiln. Bill. Widget. Darn it. There we go. It flashes like it's on for a second and then it stops. Missing. Re Am I out of certling cores? How did I run? Ah, oh, man. I'm one certling core short. I'm one short. Luckily, I got enough. Man. I'm gonna have to explore another. Oh Jesus! I'm gonna have to cover this chasm up or something. That's a whole other thing. But luckily, I have enough ore. Um. Yeah, I've got more than enough ore here. Okay, I'm carrying too much. Oh no. upgrade my deer hide cape there we go that will help with the weight as well I'm still holding too much Jesus I should put these I should put the rubies and the amber away at some point those will come in handy but for right now they're not really freaking ah, there we go Wait, wrong one this one I got the awesome Terminator skull. Get to the chopper. Get to the chopper now. Certainly, core. Weight is 20. Jesus. Still too much weight, huh? Gee, mother of God. Okay. I'm telling you guys, this ore weighs a, a load. It weighs so much. There we go. Oh man, I forgot to get charcoal. Forgot to add charcoal. I'm gonna have to cook a bunch of meat and waste it. That's what I'm gonna have to do. Well, at least the charcoal's coming in handy aside from that uh, banner. Here we go. And of course, I'm carrying too much again. And still. I got rid of you, shaman thing. Oh, that is creepy. I'm going to put that away. Stare into my soul at night while I'm trying to sleep. You kill too many of us. You kill too many of us. He will haunt your dreams now. Yes, that's right. All right. I have ore. What, what? Is this where I add him? Like, which side do I add it at? This is, what the hell? Okay. Ward. What is a ward? I mean, it's a magic seal nearby. Prevents other players from constructing build Oh. Connects to another portal with equal or no tag. 
Is this for like... Can I connect my two houses with that? I wonder. Okay, but seriously, how do I... How do I live? Okay. Let's see. Where out you? All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to look. Oh, thank God! All right, I did not know it was gonna be this much of a pain, but I figured it out, guys. It looks like I added a bunch of the copper ore. Ooh. Awesome. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to build a bunch of stuff. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Alright. Forge. And forge cooler. Copper. I need 10 copper. 25 fine wood forge. Oh, Jesus. <sighs> It's gonna be a lot. So this will be a while, guys. So I will be right back when we get all of it. All right, guys. After a while, I was able to finally make the forge. And here we go. Oh, wow. We can make a copper knife. Oh, we can get the forge bucket, which is the next thing to craft, which requires 10 copper. Let's see. Let's see. We got four copper right now. And we do not have any more ingots. I'm going to have to go back to that spot. Frick. Darn it. I'm going to have to go back to that ore spot and get some more ore. Some more ore. Ay. I think I already had some copper in here, actually. It's the it's the I wish I would have had enough to craft the the kiln, because that would have helped out a lot. But I need I need five certain core. I'm one short. If I would have gotten one more certain core, I would have had enough. So I, it's not that I don't have enough copper. I think it's because there's a, a lot of it in there. It's just I don't have enough. Um, how much copper do I have? Six. So I just need four more copper. I'm gonna have to kill some more animals to get meat to cook it to overcook it for, for the charcoal. That's what I've been doing. So I'll be back when I can do that. <laughs> Freaking one short for the kiln. Darn it! All right, guys. Now we can craft our first bronze. Here we go. Oh, we need two copper, one tin. I don't know why I can't craft it. Not letting me craft. It's very weird. It says two. Yeah, it's not letting me craft bronze. Huh. Oh, am I not gonna have? I might not have enough. That might be what it is. I'm not gonna have enough space if I... Yeah, that might be what it is. Inventory full, yep, that's what it is. Okay, so 
So I have to figure out what to do now. Well, I can get rid of the trophy, I know that for sure. Got so free many of those, I'm gonna have too many eventually here. Here we go. Alright, now we craft our first bronze. Oh my god. So much has opened up for us now. Holy mother of god. <laughs> bronze nails. Now the main thing we're looking for is the bronze pickaxe. Oh shoot, we need ten bronze? Shoot. Bronze sword. Oh my god. Slash is 35. But that's the main thing we're looking for is the bronze pickaxe so we can mine better. And then after that, um, the bronze axe after that. That'll be good. A true warrior's tool. Oh, does that replace the hammer? I'm guessing it does. Bronze plate leggings. Oh, that's going to be a while. <laughs> So we need two copper and one tin. How many do we need for the bronze pickaxes we need? Tin bronze. Oh man, we're going to have a problem here, guys. Don't have anywhere near enough bronze or enough copper. We're going to have to go back to that deposit, guys. Pretty sure I have enough tin. It's just enough... Right, yeah, we have more than enough tin. Shoot. Shoot, 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 shoot. Yeah, I knew I should have mined more of that copper. Darn. Bronze. Yeah, we're not going to have nowhere near enough. We barely have enough for nails. Bronze mace. No. Bronze spear. Yep. So I'm going to have to go back. Um, let's see. Back to crafting. Oh, shit. We got even more. Anvils? Anvils? Oh, that I can make. I wonder if that would help with anything. Shoot. That I can craft with the bronze. Well, I'm trying to save the bronze for the freaking... Uh, it's so tough. Because I could up I could get more upgrades with the... Uh... I'm just going to have to see what I can do with the, with the bronze with that, I guess. With the... And then just get find more deposits. Because that's another star thing I can make. That I can upgrade. Forge level 2. Oh, I can upgrade more stuff. But does that work with this as well? Let's see. No, that doesn't unlock level crafting floor. So that was kind of not exactly a waste, but eventually when I do craft something, I'll be able to upgrade a cultivator. Huh. Man, I got a lot more copper to get. So I'm going to have to go back to that spot and come back. But for now, I'm just going to leave the heavy stuff in here because otherwise, you just, here we go. There we go. All right. Same thing. If I go to another burial spot, I can get the, I can, I can get the, uh, thing I had before. There we go. There's the eye thing. Got loads of those. All right.
right. So I will be back when I have enough bronze for the pickaxe and stuff. I don't know how long that will take me, but I'll, I will get it. All right, guys, I found another burial chamber, and so did this guy here. So did he. Um, so we're going to go there and get more certling cores, and then uh, and then we we'll, can finally do that Kindle thing. Not Kindle thing, that's reading. Um, that kiln. <laughs> Looks almost exactly like the other one so far. Okie dokie. Evil bone pile. Oh, that spawns them. I should have kept it, kind of. Probably should have kept it. Shoot. There's the certain cores we need so bad. Certainly, for get as many of those as we can. Lord knows we need them. At some point, I think this amber and the pearls and stuff are going to pay off. I just don't know when. Get some more of these sun shrooms here. Scary skeletons in the burial chamber. Seal your doom tonight. Are these shields? Can I get them? Oh god, the ghosts of Christmas Pass. Ebenezer Scrooge. Ebenezer. Can I get these off? Nope, I guess not. Ebenezer Scrooge. Flint head arrow, I might as well. That reminds me, I left all my arrows over at the old place. Bone fragments for days. Oh, not another one of you guys. Plenty of Sirdling Core. Our weight's still doing pretty good, so we should still be able to get the copper as well. So that'll be good. Yay! I survived to tell the tale. Now I just gotta get the copper, and then, and then we'll be good to go. We'll be able to build the kiln, finally, and get the copper, and the bronze, and bronze pickaxe, and the bronze axe, and then after that, I don't know. But we'll be back, guys. Alright, guys, I got enough bronze ore to make the bronze pickaxe, but the bad part is I need core wood. So I need to go all the way back to Black Forest for that. But I figured, since I have enough bronze for the bronze axe, um, and since I need to cut down core wood, I might as well get this. It would be a good test. So I'm going to craft this. And then see if there's an upgrade for it. There is an upgrade. Good. I can upgrade it to level 2. 
It will take more bronze, but I've got plenty of bronze, plus I can go get some more when I go get the core wood. Alright, so we got... So this compared the flint axe, is, durability is 160, the slash is 30, the durability on this is 175, and the slash is 40. So it's better. I wonder how much weight it has. Weight is 2, this is... Weight is 1.5, so it's a bit weightier, but not by much. And so we have four bronze left uh, to use, so I can get some more when we go, and then we'll get the the next clip. We'll, I'll be testing it out. Let's see. Let's see how it actually looks. Oh, it looks cool. I wonder if it moves faster too. Seems to move faster. So let's see here. So I will move it to. Uh, I don't need that anymore. Move this to one. I don't need the club either. My clubbing days are over. Music is too darn loud. I'll be back, guys. So it turns out I had enough in my chest, anyways, for the for the core woods. I have plenty of that, but just just to show you guys how it works. Twenty-three, thirty, twenty-nine. Good three swings, and it. And it cuts down. I think it was four for the other one. So I'm going to get this copper deposit and then, um, yeah, get enough for the bronze pickaxe. We'll be right back. All right, guys, we're finally, finally, finally able to craft the bronze pickaxe. It has a durability of 120 and a pierce of 25. This has a durability of 100 and a pierce of 18 so this is, should be much better it should be much faster um, and we're gonna go over to, to uh, black forest and test it out and see if we can upgrade it oh we can we can upgrade it but we need more bronze of course and more core wood so if we upgrade it the durability can go even higher up to a hundred like 50 more durability and we can get more pierce I think more piercing yeah, more piercing, so shoot. So I'm going to go over to the Black Forest and we're going to test it out. I'm going to put the the, uh, the deer one in here. There we go. Yeah, we don't need either of those. i got to put the bronze away or else it's going to weigh me down ridiculously. Alrighty. So I will see you guys in the next clip, and we're going to, let's see how it looks. Oh, it looks awesome. It looks awesome. So in the next clip, we'll be mining some more copper ore in the Black Forest. Alright guys, we're back at the core deposit section here. One of the two that I've found so far, and we're going to mine it with a new bronze axe does more damage yep it's faster it's faster for sure yeah it does more 11s and more sevens and or more eights before it used to do like five seven man so much faster look at that I'm going to have to get some more tin as well, but I'm going to be progressing off screen. There's so many things to get that you, we can craft now. You can craft a sconce. You can craft um, a deer rug. Oh, well, we did, were able to do that before. But for crafting, we can make a fermenter now. It's not a dementor. It's a fermenter. Um, we can make the anvil, we can make the uh, adiz to upgrade um, the workbench. Oh, we can, we can make a cauldron now. Shoot, I forgot about that. So there's a bunch of stuff to do off screen. Um, I gotta get more tin as well. He knew not to mess with me. Are you serious? Watch this, one hit. <laughs> That's how much more powerful the bronze axe is. And now I can cut down the birch trees too. And the oak trees, no problem. 
So it's gonna be much easier with this. Look at that. Um, I'm I'm thinking about switching back, switching to bronze armor, but the only problem with the bronze armor is it slows down your movement speed. So I might stick with troll armor once I get the ADs and I can upgrade that some more. The only downside with the troll armor is the trolls really show up. So it's gonna take a while, but uh, but yeah, and I'll be able to upgrade stag breaker too. So I plan on doing a bunch of that off screen. Took us a while, guys, but we got there. We got there. We did it. I gotta get some tin ore. Shoot. Darn it. But yeah, this pickaxe, and it's more durable, too. Look at that. 16 damage. Copper deposit, nine. I don't think I've seen it do less than seven. And I've seen that a couple times with the copper axe. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys have a good day. Bye, everybody.